another pump. Pumpity pump, where are you? I can't. There it is. Alright, it's in this direction somewhere. Samantha. Your friend told me something, but I'm not sure I believe him. They said if you're going fast enough and you jump right when you hit the water, you bounce. I want to try for myself, but I'm not a good swimmer. Maybe I'll never know for sure. Playground, I saw someone really skip on the water. Get there. at all. Should I sneak over? No. I'm gonna go walk over. What you got there? The tree spouted underwater. Made it all the way to the surface. The tree? Yep. Magnolia, I think, but she's drooping now. So if I stop, stop proper in her up, she'll drown. Oh no. Do you uh, need any help? Here's a twig and some grass clippings. Oh, sure. I'll grab you some. Okay. I'll save this little tree, then turn on the pump. E easy peasy. Clear beans. Here you go. Where are they for? Watch. Well, I see them. That would be okay, right? Maybe. What? No, maybe. Why only maybe? This puddle's stagnant. The water's shallow and stationary, so, it'll, uh, so it gets dirty. I'll go get some fresh water. Okay. I'll stay here and make sure uh, no one tramples her. Here, take this. Anywhere deep enough to swim should be fine. 
Yeah, I'm gonna go to the ocean. Hopefully this is enough wa uh, uh, salt water, sure. Be in fresh water. It's certainly fresh and not the not ocean. Great, pour it on nice and gentle. Ah, it looks so much healthier. <laughs> it's wearing on his head. Just need a little support. Uh, almost good to leave on her own. What do we do next? I don't know. What do you mean? Gonna be okay? What does he need? Sunlight. Magnolias need a lot of it. This one sprouted in the shade. The roots are tangled in the ro in the rocks. Won't survive if we can move her. Not much we can do. Wait, wait. There has to be something. Hope so. Let me know if you figure it out. I know. I'll chop all the trees down. Sunlight's coming from this direction. There! For the trees! Whoa! Um... Oh, that, that went fast. I didn't even think to break the sign. That was metal. You're pretty cool, big gator bun. Fine destruction hasn't failed me yet. I'm sure Magnolia appreciates it. In fact, I bet she'd uh, like you to have this. Wow, a whole leaf. Are you sure? Sure. Bernie is normal for a strong plant like her. You know how I said Magnolias need sunlight? Uh-huh. They usually need well, uh, well-drained soil, too. Not too soggy. I've landed here. And it's three inches of water. Inside a shady cliff. Surrounded by rocks and weeds. But she sprouted anyway. Whoa, hardcore. Yeah, she's gonna be fine. Hey, Gatorbun. You know how plants need water to grow? Uh, yeah. I'm thinking maybe our little gang does too. See ya. Huh? What does he mean? Oh, the pump. I totally forgot. Let's get this thing turned on. Okay, that's all the pumps done. Time to head back and, uh, to the splash pad. Amelia. I look like a turtle. Monsters, someone help! I know it'll save you! Oh wow, you did it! Thanks goodness, you were everywhere! Or they were everywhere. I heard someone needed monsters, so I made some. I built and built and built all over the place. But then, I actually looked at one. I had no idea how scary they were. Thank you for saving me from my own creations. This is a uh, party. Wait, now the whale's here too? Hey, whale. Roar, it is I, the great monster of the lake. Beware! Hey, just kidding, it's only me. Hey, well, I'm gonna give you a hug. Hi. 
I have no idea where I came from. Um, oh, that's, that's this way. By the windmill. Yes. Why would you put park benches next to a water uh, thing? This pose is unstoppable. Things seem kind of tense over here. I better go turn the water back on quick. Alright, first, let's see what's going on with hats. Ooh, detective cow. Technically called a deer stalker. Space man. All right, need some art. Ooh. And a palette. There we go. I'm gonna bop Ross my way to victory. Wait, I've defeated everyone's pool. Now they'll have fun for sure. Here it comes. Here it comes. Ah, it's stuck again. Is it coming? I guess uh, you guys wanted water on after all. It's whatever. We're being kind of dry. Wouldn't hurt to get wet. Same. Come down for a splash sometimes. It's cool hang out with you guys or whenever. I can vibe with that. I just didn't want you guys to think it was lame. No chance, dude. Feels good to talk it out. Anything you want to add, Duke? Yeah, yeah. Uh, just with a few good hunks, uh, Duke, Duke of Cool. Actually, I got an idea I think you fellas might like. Whoa! The Duke speaks! It's an honor. What's the plan? I figure since our, uh, this is our turf and kids are out here uh, making towns, why don't we make this place a town of our own? Oh, yeah. We could uh, all be mayors of Coolsville. See some great spots for a few houses. Maybe a lounge. All the kids who want to hang with us will finally ha have an excuse to stick around. Great idea, dude. You think? Ah, squirk. You guys are too good to me. There's one more thing any town uh, needs. I bet we'll see any uh, in any second now. <laughs> there it is, the main attraction. Huh, this isn't how I imagined everyone playing in the water. I'm surprised you were able to convince anyone to turn it on at all. But you did, and talking with everyone was nice. Not to mention Coolsville is looking dope. Yeah, so, uh, ready to bring some Coolsville back to the playground town? You know it, dude. Keep the place warm for us. Quest complete! This is a perfectly shaped fishbowl. You asked him to a date yet? Okay, sorry for being a jerk about the water thing before. This whole Coolsville thing is a lot of fun and we had, had to leave our comfort zone to do it. So, yeah, thanks. How you doing? Tough, huh? There's a new tough guy in town, so you better. Yeah! Oh, how long were you standing there? I'm Banksy! Alright. Oh. Okay. 
What is that? Oh, okay. It's a rock. Okay. Oh, that's right. Speaking of rocks, we have to go and give one back to the, uh, uh, the college kids. Says, am I cool yet? I didn't have to say, uh. Alright, there's the party. I think it's this way. Yeah. Should be. Hot, so uh, that was my smithing spirit. Let it here and we'll get it started. What? Is it good rock? Looks like basalt. Sea floor basalt with veins of quartz. Basalt is perfect because it, uh, it's easier to break down than granite, but heavier and more solid than pumice. Not to mention, the fault lines are superb. It should fracture into the shape we, uh, we want all on its own. Did you know that sounds about the uh, time pa Paleolithic animals evolved to walk upright? They would. Alright, yes, it's a good rock. Eh, sorry. It's a really good rock and it has cool lines, which of course means it's very magic. Now all we have to do is heat it up and apply pressure to it so it fractures. Venture, should I sit on it? I was thinking you hit it with a button. Hit it a bunch. You know, like blacksmith. Oh, violence! I can do violence! Then, have at it, hero. Hold your tool of violence into one of your, uh, one of creation. Yeah, I'm gonna paint on it. It. it has reached a critical state. He looks terrified. Raise yourself. One final touch should stabilize it. I'm going in. Wow. Ah. Almost there. Special effect. Ah, ah. We did it. We did it. The transformation is complete. From ash and sweat, we have made our mark upon the world. Where is it? Where is it? A magic sword? Ooh, ooh, is it a laser wand? Power ring? Key to the underworld? Better than all that by landslide. This is a historic landmark. You can look for yourself. You have earned this noble tool. It's a rock attached to a stick with a piece of string and some lines on it, I guess. Is that? to see gator bun this isn't just a rock and a stick it's transformative in the footsteps of the engineers of old we forged the form foremother of all tools from nothing but the earth's bounty it must be millennia even hundreds of millennia by now since our two very distinct lineages united under the exact goal unless you can count the neolithic and paleolithic as indistinct in which case ah no more your please no more head hurt do it yourself well that wraps up my project for today i'll head to the playground as soon as the other uh, paragons are finished are you sure you don't want to hang around and hear all about nope thanks for the rock see you there bye 
All of Jill's friends, I did so much boring work. And it backfired. Every single one of them just got even more into their projects. I had to tell Jill the bad news. Thank you all for watching. You're welcome to come see me record these episodes live at twitch.tv slash superbunnybun. You can also come say hi on Twitter at superbunnybun. But most importantly, I'd really appreciate it if you could like yourself, comment about how awesome you are, and subscribe to Happy Thoughts. And until next time, stay feisty and huggable. Bye!